today we're on our way to Lewis Creek Trail, a five and a half mile hike up right past Oakhurst. Here we go. Okay, so we made it to Lewis Creek Trail. We have trail insignia there. We also have watch out for mountain lions because you might get attacked. Not like that. Oh, nice. We're doing a video. Oh, hey. There, yeah, there we go. We decided to go over that water. We made it. Okay. okay. I've only done the side over there, but now we have this wonderful view from a different angle, which we will definitely get the other side of Lewis Creek in a sec after we finish, figure out when this one ends. Yeah. Oh, these? Oh, that is one. Oh, yeah. Okay, it's a small one. Oh, there's uh, thorns over here. These plants here have thorns. Okay, so we've decided to take a small break. Um, doing our thing on our hiking trail. Looks like we've been out here for about 30 minutes. Pretty close. Oh, we've got 37, 34 for elevation, 29.26 and 93. I think that's my heartbeat right now. So um, having a good time. We're nowhere near done, but 30 minutes in. Oh, you know what? There's water that's going to run multiple different areas, so to lead down into that. Oh, this is really nice. Made it to the end of the trail on one end. Okay, we're on the far end, but we basically parked in the middle. So because we parked in the middle, we're gonna have to walk through to the other side where we came and then go across that to another side of the trail and then come back halfway and go up to our car. But we are about two miles out. Down there, just shows elevation there but the timing but we're probably about two two and a half miles out probably about halfway through going back Oh, that sign on it? Oh, I don't know. Tans one? That's a sticker, huh? Yeah, I don't know.
so we made it to the other side of this hiking trail and we're already getting some good scenes here. We are at the end of the trail and we're just coming back from the end. So we're at a snack area. From here, we're gonna go up, a lot of up. And then we'll be back at the cars and we'll be done with our hike for the day. Okay, so we just finished the hike. Oh, kind of had technical difficulties with my watch. So we have four hours, 23 minutes on the hike. We're at about a 37, 43 elevation now. And we're just shy of seven miles, 3,455 calories burned. And let's see, yeah. Finish that workout. There we go. Good hike. Now, every time we a good hike, there's the information. 821 is when we started to hike, Sarah. The 1257. Okay. Um, anytime you go on a good hike, it's always a good time to go out and get some good food in the area. Um, yeah, so that'll be the next step. Here to get some else heads. Great Mexican food cuisine and very good after a long hike.
Okay, and just like that, all done with our hike. Uh, at the end of the day, I would say that was a moderate hike. So maybe for a little bit more experienced of a hiker. I would say if you're going to take the left angle first, and I mean cli or climbing over the log at the Lewis Creek Trail, you're going to go that way. That is more of a beginner's hike. Longer hike, but it's more of a beginner's. If you decide to come back and you want to do the right side instead, the uphill portion, I would say that that is more of a moderate hike. You can do both. You can do one of them. My first experience was just doing the uphill portion of that hike as one hike in itself. Um, it, that was also a great hike as you saw. You can do just that one. It's a little shorter, maybe about two and a half miles tops. Um, but it is a lot of incline coming back up. So that's where the strenuous moderate comes from. The other side was more of a beginner's, but you can do one, both, or, or have them all done at the same time. So other than that, have a good one.